yo, 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 what's going on, everyone? I am live. Hope everyone's doing well out there. I will give it about a minute and a half, see if anybody wants to hop on in and get these gems that I'm about to drop down for y'all. Really, really good information, really good stuff I'm, I want to share with you all. I've been researching, you know, routines, morning routines, nightly routines. Uh, but there's one part of the day that kind of gets looked over. That's the afternoon. So today, I'm just coming live to share a little information that I've found um, through some research to help you win your afternoon. Like I said, I'll just give give someone, anyone, a second to see if they want to jump on in or, hey, you might want to catch it on a replay. I suggest you do because uh, this is some something that I think you can benefit from. And I know for a fact that there's somebody on your timeline that can benefit from it as well. So, until then, how's everyone doing? Talk to me. Talk to me. Tell me how you are. How's this week going for you? Is it going good? Is it going bad? Can can you not tell? You know, talk to me. Do, do, do. Do, do. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I was about to type down here like I had a keyboard down here, but I don't. Uh oh. Here we go. Oop. Let's go ahead and pin that at the bottom. And now we're good. Okay. So let's talk about winning your afternoon, right? So I've seen morning routines. I've seen nightly routines. But the one thing that seems to always get looked over is your afternoon. I don't know why, but I just figured it would be a great opportunity to kind of put a little something together and share it with you all. So the one thing that I definitely want you to do is to take a break. That's tip number one. Take a break. Whether it's taking a walk, inside or outside. Preferably outside if you're working inside of a building. Fresh air, you can't beat it. So take a walk. Um, this is a perfect time to maybe do some breathing exercises to kind of calm you down if you've had a stressful morning or just had an early morning. I know if you, if you guys are like me, my day starts around 6 o'clock. I'm up and out of bed and making coffee and all that good stuff, getting ready to to take on the day. So it's good just to take a walk, take a break, do some breathing exercises, maybe get a little meditation in there. If you have time, maybe even like a 15, 20 minute nap just to just to re-energize yourself. I was looking on online and there was a um a blog post that someone broke down there like dailies of uh, their morning routine, their afternoon routine, which is kind of crazy, and then their nightly routine. And I don't know if you know this, but fun fact, in Venezuela, they get two hours to take their lunch break. Their lunch break is two hours. So they work from 8 to 12. They go to lunch from 12 to 2 and come back and work 2 to 6. I mean, 
I would be down to adopt that method. I'm just saying. But so in those two hours, you know, she talks about how she eats a really, really good and healthy um, a lunch with her family. And they have time to, you know, talk and uh, be in a community or whatever they need to do. She has time for a nap. So if you have time for a nap, go ahead and take you a nap, a little power nap, get you re-energized and revitalized. Um, so take a break. Okay. Take a break. Detach and disengage from your morning. Especially if you had a rough morning. Um, things maybe not going the way you planned or whatever the case may be. Now is the time to take a deep breath, step back, and let that be what it is. Tip number two is to eat a healthy lunch, right? So often we get so wrapped up in our jobs, in our, in our careers, in our just daily doings that we forget to eat. Eat lunch. Eat something that will nourish your body and your brain, you know, and also drink water. Drink water. You have to. It's a non-negotiable. Drink water. Eat and eat and eat, okay? Whether it's, you know, a shake, a salad, a burger, whatever it is, eat for your body type and for your brain and, and its needs, okay? Eat and drink water. This is a good time for some tea as well. If you want to add a little tea in there, have some tea. I know tea calms me, so I'll I'll, I'll definitely drink some tea during my break time. Tip number three is to listen to some mood music. That has literally saved lives for me. No, I'm just kidding. But seriously. Listen to something that's either going to to hype you up um, and get you motivated to knock out the rest of your day or something that'll chill you out. Whatever whatever you need, whatever mood you need to be in, whatever mindset you need to be in, listen to something that engages and promotes that that set of 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 thinking or whatever the case may be. Something that will help you um, realign with where you're going in your day, in your daily routine. Honestly, if you know me, you know how I feel about Lady Gaga. So Chromatica has been my savior since its release. I'm just saying, I will listen. I found on YouTube, someone was able to upload it with like no breaks and it just plays so smooth. Also go download it and pay for it too. Did that. Just saying, but listen to something that's going to stimulate you in 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 the the mindset and the mood that you need to be in. Those are some tips for you to help you win your afternoon. To reiterate and and revisit those tips. First tip I said was to take a break, and for real, leave your work, whatever you're doing, leave it where it is. Get up and get away. Go for a walk, breathing exercises, meditation, taking a a 20 minute power nap, whatever it is, but take a break, like a serious break. Number two is, uh uh-oh, number two is eating something healthy, eating something that will help your body and your brain needs, and also drinking water. You need it. Non-negotiable. Number three, listening to some mood music. Something that will help stimulate you on your path and and help you get from A to B to C to D and wherever else you need to go in the rest of your day. Something that will get you pumped up if you know you, you're going to the gym, you know. Just like just like that. If you think about it, you're going to the gym, you're not gonna listen and you're not gonna listen to like um maybe Death Cat for Cutie or something like that. If you're going to the gym, you're gonna listen to some I know The Rock has a a bomb playlist on Spotify. I'm just saying. Just saying. But those three tips will help you win your afternoon and ultimately help you win your day. 
I hope this was beneficial for you. If it wasn't, oh well, it was beneficial for me. And I know it's beneficial for someone on your timeline. With that being said, feel free to share this. This good information that I've come up with and I wanted to come in here and, and break it down for you. There's morning afternoon there's morning routines and nightly routines, but no one ever talks about that in between time. So I just want to take this time to do that. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, please like, comment, share, go to my YouTube, subscribe, because that's going, that's where this is going. And also have a wonderful day. Remember, you are uniquely created and we will talk very, very soon. See ya.